Skeeter. Skeeter, you good boy? You like your new land? I feel like we need some Kyle's Cabin mugs. What do you guys think? A little picture of the cabin. We're out for our afternoon stroll here. So there's a lot of these forest trails that all kind of connect together and go pretty far back in the forest here. So it makes for really pretty walking. Right, Skeet? He's loving it. He's hunting. He's just smelling all the smells and chasing after things. <laughs> Skeeter, come on! Good boy! Yeah, like I was saying, at our new land here, these, these, there's these trails everywhere and they all, well, most of them lead to a lake or, or something cool. And it's all national forest land, so there's pretty much endless land for us to explore out here. I think you could walk all these trails every day and still not walk them all. So it's been a lot of fun. We've been out exploring kind of new trails every day here. A couple of remote lakes that we'll show you guys in upcoming videos that we're going to fish. They got trout in them and good crappie fishing, so we're hoping that uh, I can put some food on the table. Since here, I won't be able to. Guys, I always outfish you. She has been outfishing me lately. I kind of suck lately. Made a little town run for some groceries today. Oh no, my skirt fell. Oh no. Oh, it's warm in here. Yeah, it's not bad. We had to fill up a uh, propane cylinder. Not used to this propane heat, man. I'm used to wood heat, but works pretty nice for this little place. And now we're going to organize and clean up. It's looking better in here. Yeah, it is. It's nice that you can actually walk over there. I know. So this is where the wood stove was and um, you can see how much more we can use this space you know that was kind of the I hated to get rid of the stove uh, like I said just because we love wood heat so much but it just gave us so much more room right here to have I mean in a small space like this we got to take advantage of pretty much every square inch so it's really bugging me that I can't work on the sink and shower right now but I don't have any tools here so they're all at the cabin so when I Go to the cabin, um, uh, when I hike on out of there, I'll have to sled all my tools out so I can get the shower wrapped up and then the sink. So stay tuned for that video. I'm going to do uh, fall public three. Okay. That's what we said last time. Yeah. So that's what we Yeah. We'll face the sunset so we can watch the sunset. Okay.
Does it seem like a lot more ice than the last time? No, it's about the same. Pretty close. Up there. Teamwork makes the dream work. Baby. Come on, baby. A lot of people were worried about Skeeter when we're out fishing in cold weather and stuff, about his paws. He lays right in the sleigh here with his little blankie, so, and it's about 450 degrees in here right now, so. <laughs> He's plenty warm. It is plenty warm in here. Figured I'd do a little free advertising for uh, a Minnesota brewery here, Castle Danger. Good stuff. This is the IPA. Since I'm a millennial, I like IPAs. Good stuff. Pretty good, pretty good. Well, tonight wasn't our night. Nope. Skunked. Yep. Oh, buddy. Skeeter's helping. Get down, Skeet. Skeeter, no. Get down. Skeeter, come here. Come on. Good boy, come on. I think Skeeter farted before he took a crap right there. <laughs> it stinks though. <laughs> Good boy, Skeeter. Good job helping. Let's go. I get a lot of comments saying like, you know, especially when I'm at the cabin, like, oh, you're not off grid. Like, how are you posting YouTube videos? Or, you know, you're not, 
How, how do you have lights if you're not if you're off grid? The grid that they're talking about is the the power grid. So those of you that have the power grid have an electrical bill because you're tied to the grid where everybody else is tied to. If you're off grid, you don't have an electrical bill. So just because you're off grid doesn't mean that you can't have power. That generator that I just started over there, that's how we get our power. So once that thing's running, now the the cabin on wheels here has power, it has lights, has a fridge, which we don't really use this time of year because it's cold out, but um, yeah, it has we can charge our phones, all that stuff, but we're still off grid. So like I said, the grid is the power grid, the power lines, that's the grid. Um, if you're not connected to that, I mean, you're off grid. That's, that's all that means. So you can still live comfortably off grid. And then I got, everything is wired in a continuous circuit in here. And then once we plug, that cord's plugged into the generator like you saw, and then once that's plugged in, then it's all one circuit because all we have in here is LED lights, the TV, which TVs don't draw anything. So it's pretty much just the lights and outlets and that little fridge, which draws nothing, but that's not even plugged in right now. So we're hooked up.